lockdown cocktails, the French martini, but made with creme de cassis because I didn't want to go into a supermarket to buy Chambord. So presentation, I'm gonna serve this one in a martini glass. Everyone knows this, this is one of the most famous cocktails in the world. Your shaker, this is called a Boston shaker. This is what you'll see in bars, but you can just use one of the ones you can pick up in Tesco if you want. They're just as good. All you're doing is shaking up and mixing the liquid inside. Fill it with ice, okay? Fill the whole thing with ice. The ice is gonna cool it down. <laughs> You've got your measure here. You can use a little cup, something at home like that, as long as you just get roughly the equivalent um, ingredients. So what we're gonna do first is, like I said, I didn't wanna go to the supermarket to buy Chambord. I'm using creme de cassis. Chambord, raspberry liqueur, creme de cassis, blueberry liqueur. I'm gonna do one shot of Chambord or creme de cassis as I'm using. We're gonna do one shot of vodka. I'm using Smirnoff. Every cocktail you find has at least two shots of alcohol in it. If they don't do that, if you're on a Turkish party boat after lockdown and you see them putting half a shot in it, you're being ripped off. Take that wristband off, dive in the water and swim back to shore, okay? Um, the last ingredient is pineapple juice, which is nice. It's full of vitamin C to get your immune system up. That's what we all need right now. After you've done your hit workout, this is a great way to refresh. This goes on here. Bang, okay? Give it a little pull in case you're doing it over your, your beautiful rug. And then, have fun, shake. It's part of your exercise, okay? Give it a bash on the side. The top should pop off nice and easy. We've got one of these. This is what keeps the ice inside. You push it down and the other thing we need is the fine strainer. This is our fine strainer. The pineapple juice gets really beautiful and foamy. That's what gives the French martini its wonderful kind of silky smoothness to it. Every cocktail needs a garnish, so we're gonna garnish our French martini with a raspberry right in the middle, this side up so it doesn't sink. Voila! Enjoy. After you've done your Joe Wicks or your Courtney Black, guzzle one of those. <laughs>